Hi everybody, welcome to this video. This video is designed to demonstrate for you the idea of a distress tolerance box so that all your distress tolerance skills can be put into one place so that it's a helpful reminder to you of the skills that you can use. Often if you're in your emotional mind, the typically feels like you can't think very clearly and you can't problem solve or think through consequences so it's often hard to remember the strategies when you're in that emotional state so having something like a distress tolerance box there to remind you can be helpful because all you need to do is remember to go to the box and the more you practice that the more used you'll get to to using it now it doesn't have to be a box it could be a poster with some of the skills written up it could be um, uh, a song that you write, it could be a diary, a journal where you keep all your ideas, um, it can just be a list up on, on the fridge. But for me, I like the idea of a distress tolerance box um, because you can you can keep it, you can take it around with you, you can um, find it when you, you need it, you know, you could just keep it under your bed or somewhere. Um, so my distress tolerance box is decorated in flowers because for me that is a reminder to go and be outdoors so a bit of self-soothing um, go and be be out in nature be in the garden do some gardening would be a good strategy for me to use anyway so even just looking at the box is a bit of a, a bit of self-soothing and a bit of a reminder to do that in my box I also have a flower for the same reason really to remind me of some of the strategies um, around self-soothing so maybe pick some flowers and bring them indoors maybe look at something beautiful some artwork some photos or go and be out, be out in nature so you can customize your your distress tolerance box to have in it whatever is most helpful for you um, in here I've got some ideas that relate to the thoughts so accept skill T thoughts things like sudoku word searches little pocket ones that you can take with you in your in your bag or carry around with you now it's really easy to find them on your phone as well and have access to crosswords and puzzles and things um, when you're out and about it's pretty easy there's um, a scented candle which can be really nice self-soothing or even a mindfulness exercise if you light it and then pay attention watching it describing it non-judgmentally it can be a nice mindfulness activity to do I have these um, quote cards so these just um, a whole load of different statements that I might read through again trying to be quite mindful read through them and just remind myself of some of these statements or sentiments which can help me to reframe some of my thinking a little bit some of those might fit into the um, encouragement skill so in wise mind improved skills the E for encouragement 